In this video, we will discuss about double entry system. If it is beneficial, please subscribe, like and share. What is double entry system? Double entry refers to an accounting concept whereby assets equals to liabilities plus owners equity. In the double entry system, transactions are recorded in terms of debits and credits. Accounting uses the double entry system, which means that we record the dual effects of each transaction. As a result, every transaction affects at least two accounts. It would be incomplete to record only the giving side or only the giving side of a transaction. This is the double entry accounting. The T account must have two sides. Debit is the left side of the accounts and the credit is at the right side of the accounts. Rules of debit and credit. For assets, expenses and drawing have Debit normal balance while liability, equity and revenue have credit normal balance. If asset, expenses or drawing increase, we record in the debit side. If assets, expenses and drawing decrease, we record in credit side. While, if liability, equity and revenue increase, we record in credit side. But if liability, equity and revenue decrease, we record in debit side. Or, you can determine the debits and credits using accounting equation assets equals to liabilities plus owners equity. Just look at the effects, those are plus or minus. For assets, if the effects is plus, so record it as debit, while if it is minus, so record it as credits. But this is opposite to liability and owner equity. If the effect is minus, so it is recorded as debit, while if it is plus, so it is recorded as credit. Now, let us take a look at example of Will Smith for the transaction in July 2015. Requirements A. Indicate the effects of each transaction and the balances after each transaction. B. Record the transaction in general journal according to rules of debit and credits. Please refer to the previous live video for accounting equation for answer to question A using the link given. We will discuss for answer to question B using accounting equation answer in A.
To record the general journal and to determine the debits and credits, look at the effect of plus or minus. Using the rules of debits and credits, if asset increase, it will be recorded as debit and vice versa. While for liabilities and honest equity, if it is increased, it will be recorded as credit and vice versa. So, the answer for A is debit cash 35,000 and credit capital 35,000. For answer B, debit office supplies 350 and credit accounts payable 350. For answer C, debit land 30,000 and credit cash 30,000. For answer D, debit cash 1,900 and credit revenue 1,900. For answer E, debit accounts payable 100 and credit cash 100. For answer F, debit expenses 500 and credit cash 500. And lastly, for answer G, debit drawings 1,200 and credit cash 1,200. That's all for now. If you like this video, please subscribe, like and share. Thank you for watching. Bye.